This video is about IgA vasculitis, also known as Henoch-Schonlein purpura, or HSP. If you're curious about what it is, you've come to the right place. It's called IgA vasculitis because IgA, which normally fights infection, gets stuck in your tiny blood vessels. Your own body may then attack these vessels, making them swollen so they leak into your skin, joints, intestines, and kidneys. IgA vasculitis can happen after a mild illness, especially a throat infection, because there is lots of IgA in your mouth. It is very common to get a bumpy red or purple rash on your arms or legs. This is called purpura and may look like bruising. You may have soreness and swelling in your ankles or other joints. You may also get some tummy pains or blood in your poo, although this isn't common. Rarely part of your intestine may slide into another part, causing a blockage, meaning if you have very bad tummy pain, you need to be seen by a doctor urgently. You may feel quite tired, and it can affect your kidneys. Let's remind ourselves what our kidneys do to keep us healthy. They clean our blood by removing waste, extra salt, and water to produce urine or wee help control our blood pressure, tell our bodies to make new red blood cells, and keep our bones healthy. All of these can be affected by IgA vasculitis. You may get swollen around your ankles or eyes because your swollen kidney blood vessels can make you leak protein in your urine. It's very important to get urine tests to see if blood and protein are leaking into your urine from your blood vessels. If these are present, your kidneys may not be working normally. The kidneys can stay affected even when everything else gets better, so it's important to keep testing your urine for at least six months, either with regular samples for your doctor or nurse to check, or they may teach your parents how to test it. Over the first few months, you will have regular appointments to see how you are doing. You may need to see the kidney team in another hospital. Most children get better without any treatment. The skin rash can take a few weeks to go away and may come and go. The soreness and swelling in your joints can come and go but will eventually get better too. Painkillers can help. However, in a few, there may be lasting effects on the kidneys which need treatment. Your doctors may give you medicines to try to stop this. Your doctor can tell you more if these are needed. Thanks for watching. We hope you now know more about IgA vasculitis. More information can be found at the link below.